In daily life, you are exposed to all kinds of radiation. And as technology advanced over the years, doctors have ordered more CT scans. Neuroradiologist Stephen Polai. As CT scanners got faster, we started scanning people uh, for more and more indications because before we couldn't do them. Leading to increased radiation exposure for patients. Federal statistics show Americans received seven times more radiation in 2006 than in the 1980s. Much of that radiation dose coming from CT scans. We customize the exam so that the patient gets as least an amount of radiation as possible. Randy Jorgensen has been running CAT scans for a decade. Over time, he's seen dose management change. Safety here at CDI is one of our primary concerns uh, to keep the dose exposure of the patient to a minimum. So what the technologists do is review the orders prior to doing the scan to make sure that the symptoms match the area that we're being scanned. In 2011, the American College of Radiology launched a National Dose Index Registry. Within two years, the registry had tracked more than 9 million CT exams. We were one of the first adopters of the National Registry to keep track of uh, radiation dosage. It's pretty dramatic, actually. So CDI is kind of in the leading front of the dose reduction. We monitor all our doses and record them after each exam, and we compare that to the national average to make sure our doses are right where they need to be. The tracking has paid off for patients. In general, our doses are 30 to 50 percent less than the national averages. If your doctor orders a CT scan, there are questions you should ask to protect yourself from unnecessary radiation exposure. Will they use a special shield to protect body parts that are more sensitive to radiation? Does the scanner have automated exposure control features? AEC software can reduce radiation dose by up to 40 to 50 percent. Is the person operating your scan accredited for CT? And ask your doctor, why are you doing this test and what do you hope to find that you didn't know from the last test? These answers will help you weigh the benefits and the risks. Our goal is to have the least amount of radiation with the highest quality.